Pokemon games are usually quite peaceful. I mean, apart from the fact that evil organizations try to destroy the world, it's pretty calm. Well, what if a series of natural disasters was about to occur and take out the entire world? Well, that's the story of Pokemon Gaia. I name myself Woof, and I begin my journey in Salanto Town in the region of Orbris, where I had borrowed a book from the library with significant importance and I was requested to go and return it. I call you here because of the book in your possession. It doesn't belong to the library. It's actually a family heirloom of mine. I believe the librarian stole it from me. As you can understand, it means a lot to me and I need it back. Would you be so kind? I don't think so. What? In that case, I challenge you to a Pokemon battle. I don't have any Pokemon. Oh, you have no Pokemon. I suppose you're gonna have to hand it over, won't you? That's right. Well, that's not fair. Thank you very much. Now, I have business to attend to, but you have helped me greatly. I'll be sure to scold that librarian when I see him next. Farewell, child. What is that about? That old lady seemed to be off the rails, but not much we can do about that. So my starter Pokemon is who I went for next. That leaves you with the choice of these three rare Pokemon. Please, go and choose. We got a Chimchar. Cool. A Turtwig and a Piplup. Come on, how can we not go for Chimchar? Let's take this guy. And we'll call you Monkey. Arkantan was next up on my adventure, where the professor awaited me with some gifts and some news. Like I said at Salanto Town, I need help. At the moment though, the two of you aren't prepared. Yo, professor, don't underestimate me. My monkey is capable of some exceptional things. So to get you started, I made you these. They're your very own care packages. Take yours, woof. Let's see what's inside. We got a Pokedex, a Redwood card, and a town map. Quite the set of gear, no? Uh, I guess. They're worrying me. As you know, the elders were wiped out by similar earthquakes. If these quakes are related, the whole region could be in danger. So to get this started, we should check out Arkham Tunnel. That's where I'm headed. I hope to see the two of you there. No, there's been sightings of these earthquakes again. Now, I couldn't wait to go and learn more about what's going on in this region, so I made it down Arkham Cave where I found this room. Yo, what is this place? Is that a Clefairy? Yo, this is awesome. Wait, it's gonna battle us. All right, a level five Clefairy has appeared. Yo, monkey, I think we got this. Come on, just one more hit and it's over. Let's go for an ember and down goes the Clefairy. Well, that was a tough battle, but where's the professor? What was that all about? Well, it turns out it was just a cool room, nothing special to it, at least yet. But for now, I made it out the tunnel and bumped into the professor again. This is Sero's village. That part of Arkham Tunnel had nothing of interest, it seems. Uh, I don't know, that Clefairy was pretty cool. There is definitely increased seismic activity there, though. You're right about that. Maybe we're just not looking in the right places. Perhaps there's a second entrance to the tunnel. I mean, I saw the entrance behind a ledge, but I didn't see much else. Good luck, you two. Well, <laughs> thank you. The gym leader is Fernando, and he uses fairy types. I mean, hey, I guess for now, we'll just take on the first gym. All right, time for the first gym battle. Fernando, let's try it out. All right, first up, he has a Clefairy. That's actually a pretty cool ball. Next up, Ralts. Okay, he should be pretty safe. Ralts fainted, and last up, a Jigglypuff. Oh, are you kidding me? Please. Oh, let's try this again. Okay, Monkey evolved. Yes. Okay, I think now we can beat the first gym leader. This better be enough. Please, please let it be over. Yes. All I needed was an overleveled and overevolved Pokemon. But we did it. We got the gym badge. Wow, that doesn't count. I'm not giving you my badge. What do you mean? Wait, did he really just run away? He stormed out of here and threw his Pokeballs at me. He ran off to Wisp Forest, but he has no Pokemon with him. Oh, I guess. So the gym leader is here all alone in a forest full of... Hermes? Oh no, what is he ever gonna do? I guess we gotta go save him now. Wait, honestly, I saw a Duskull, but I kinda want a Shroomish. Yeah, let's bring you with us. Come on, one more. Let's get it. Oh... We caught a Shroomish. I think I'll call you Weed. Oh, here he is, throwing a fit. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. Uh, I'm too scared for apologies. Please, take the Mystic Badge and let's just go home. Imagine I just left him here. I took his badge and I leave him here. I think that's the ideal outcome. Oh, wait, this looks like another entrance to the cave. And we just got cut, so let's go and explore. Woof, who's barking this time? It's the professor. <laughs> What's up with this guy? That looks like the exit we were looking for. <laughs> I'll go and get Bark. <laughs> All right. Whoa, how have I never found this before? That's true. There was two pretty big trees in front of it. This tablet is fascinating. It's, uh, it looks a lot like the one in Arkham Town, doesn't it? An old friend of mine used to study this language. His name is Herschel. He's a Pokemon trainer, too. If we're gonna translate this tablet, we will certainly need him. Last I heard, he was headed to Era City to curate its museum. The two of you should go and find him. I guess that's where we're off to next. All right, Era City, here we are. 
Now let's go find Herschel. Ooh, this guy looks scary. What's up here? The Eris Museum is er uh, having an exhibit. Yeah, you don't believe me? Ah, oh, you're a belligerent child. I'll make you pay. What? I just asked a question. You are challenged by the museum clerk. <laughs> that does not look like a museum clerk to me. Oh man, this is bad. I've got to tell the boss. Wait, what about Herschel? Where is he? All right, I guess we'll explore the museum. You, my friend, are not Herschel. Nobody can go upstairs. We'll see about that. Haha, <laughs> I got you. Fine, go upstairs. That's that's more like it. That's what I thought. Look, I see a lot of these guys, but no Herschel. And that is our main priority. Your help would be invaluable. I've already given you my answer. It would not be prudent to ask again. Herschel, I feel I have not explained myself properly. Wait, what is what is she trying to get from Herschel? It's clear I won't be persuading you anytime soon. Thank you for your time. We're finished here. I guess these guys want to read their runes too. Huh. Oh, good day, child. I presume you saw that. If you are curious, these people were ridiculous fanatics. I want no involvement with them. Charles, er, Professor Redwood is a great friend of mine. What's that? He sent you here to find me. Arcan Tunnel, the old language. How intriguing. I'll wait for you at the exit of Era City. We can go together. Well, that was easy. I can only decipher the odd word. It seems to be saying, the earth is waking up. And it mentions Apex Temple here. Apex Temple? That's the temple at the peak of Mount Ignis, right? Maybe we can find some answers about the tremors from the temple. Woof! <laughs> what is that answer? Okay, this has to be one of the top 10 names for a Pokemon character. Woof. The mystery unfolds. How exciting. You should head to Apex Temple, and this means climbing Mount Ignis. Good luck, Woof. With the professor's blessing, I traveled through the Arkan Tunnel and ended up in the Nest Pine Climb, which led me to Nest Pine Town. And here, I battled my rival who took me out way too many times. I literally failed like eight times in a row until I finally had some luck. <gasps> oh, we got a crit! Yes! <laughs> I think we did it. Come on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and the battle's over. Finally, we can move on. Now, it wasn't long until my next big challenge, because next up was the second gym leader, who of course had to be a flying type user. So super effective against both my teammates. How fun. So to counter this, I went ahead and caught myself an ice type Pokemon to help me out here, and this guy is who I went for. Oh, a Sphil. Wait, that's actually kind of perfect. Yeah, you know what? Let's get it. Wait, we only have one Pokemon left. Come on. First time's a charm. That's the quote, right? Yes, it is. We got it. Spiel, you are mine. Now, what's a good name for this guy? You know what? You can't go wrong with Fishfinger. Let's do it. Welcome to the party. Now, after a lot of leveling, and I mean a lot, because the stupid seal kept dying to literally every Zubat in this cave. Yo, our fish is evolving. <laughs> it might stop being useless. Oh, what a good day. <laughs> what a good day. Hello there, Celio. I went to challenge the second gym, and the puzzle here was actually super cool. Hey, look at that. We have three Shatas here. And they make sound too. Oh, so we gotta memorize these and play them back. That's so cool. Honestly, I really like that. Now, I'm not known to have the biggest of brains, but I did eventually figure it out. Red? Maybe? Yes! Let's go. Oh, wait, so this is where the gym leader is. I was so confused. Oh, well, I guess we just gotta take you on. Now, let's see how this goes with our newly evolved fish finger. Let's go for that Aurora Beam. Will it be enough? Yes, let's go. All right, Gligar should be even easier. There is no way this isn't a one hit. Come on, let's go. And last up is, oh, of course, it's a Shatot. But honestly, you could have gone for a better Pokemon here because it is time for you to go down. Wait, or not? No, I think he got us. Oh, okay, I think Monkey should still have this though. Oh, we're confused again. We got it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. This battle was truly breathtaking. Woof. Why is everybody barking at me? The people in this region must think I'm a dog or something, but hey, that's besides the point. Next up, I went back to explore Frostbite Cave and found a familiar face waiting at the end of it. Oh, not you again. I lost you at the museum. And you're gonna lose again now. Wait, that's another earthquake. What? These tremors are scary. Are you sure we should be here? You've got your orders. Just do as you're told. What was that all about? This operation of ours. It's the beginning of a new age. Age, kid. Sounds kind of like Cyrus to me. Ha, <laughs> copycats. What is the status of the operation? The target is secured, ma'am. We have Regice, but for now it is still dormant. Wait, so is this plot focused around the Regis? Hmm, very well. Gather the others and leave. Ensure you are not spotted. <laughs> I'm literally right behind you. What do you mean? The last thing we need is civilian interference. Uh, Eunice, ma'am. Well, spill it out. <laughs> I'm literally right here. The child from the museum. Huh, you must be lost. This place is not safe for the likes of you. Go back the way you came and leave the adults alone, okay? Really? You're just not gonna let me pass. Oh, 
You, deal with this child. Yeah, yes, Eunice, ma'am. Come on, she's not that scary. I'll have to take care of this child myself. Oh, we get to battle her. Your insistence is rather irritating, child. My name is Eunice, Elder Knight of the New Elders. I will make you regret disobeying my orders. We'll see about that one. Oh, this battle music is sick. And we still have a frost lass. Hey, we got it. She really wasn't so bad. But honestly, had quite a cool team, not gonna lie. Hmm, fine. I concede. You may pass, but speak of this to no one. Believe me, child, the dawn of a new age is imminent. This really is Cyrus V2. It would be dangerous for you to get involved any further. Are they trying to create earthquakes or stop them? That's something I'm sure we'll get answers to later on, but for now, our adventure continues. Windmist Town was absolutely beautiful, but the gym here was locked, so that was no good. But after a bit of exploring, I made my way forwards. Another kid? I'll take you down. Yeah, I don't know about that, my friend. Oof. Oh, what? <laughs> what did I just say? <laughs> this is crazy. Who are these guys? They just started attacking me. I've got this guy. You should check out the temple and find out what's happening. Modernity is evil. Oh my word, guys. I was born in the wrong generation. That's literally what these guys sound like. Yo, wait a minute. This temple looks amazing. What is this, a Zatu? Oh, let's go check it out. The Apex Temple. There was a lot more bad guys in this temple, but we took them out eventually. Wait, is that the book from earlier? Whomever you are, your efforts to stop us are futile. With this artifact, I can now awaken Reggie Rock. Oh, so these guys are going after all the Reggies. In short, you're too late, but do not fear. Our intentions are noble, and the modern world is corrupted. We intend to cleanse it of its impurities. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I've heard that one before, and it didn't go so well for anybody. <laughs> All will be revealed in due time, but for now, I bid you farewell, child. Wait, so we're too late again. If these new elder weirdos already have red eyes, and that Enoch guy is chasing Reggie Rock, we have to stop them. Maybe there are some clues in here that will let us know where they're headed next. Let's get searching. It's an old book. A Pokemon is painted on one page in large, bold strokes. On the other page is a painting of an island. We should take this book to the professor and see if he knows which island that is. There's a phone at the Pokemon Center in Windmist City. Let's head there now so we can get in touch with him. So Reggie Steel might be on an island. I guess that's where we're headed to next then. It was rather lucky you caught me. Now, what is this kerfuffle all about? I see, that is quite serious. You're sure he said he was after Reggie Rock? Yes, and this book Wolf found confirms it. Do you know where that island is, Professor? It's quite an old painting, so it doesn't really resemble it nowadays, but that spire unmistakably belongs to Sabulo Tower, and they must be headed to Sabulo Island. Woof, let's go to Era City. Not so fast. I see you're adamant about taking these new elders on, and they may well be behind the quakes. However, I don't want to see either of you getting harmed. You and your Pokemon should train more. In fact, I just met Nina, who is the gym leader here. She was headed to reopen her gym. You should both go and face her. Well, I guess that sells it for now. We'll get that third gym badge and then go try and save Regirock. Wait a minute, is this actually a fire-type gym? Oh, that's so cool, actually. We have a fire-type gym in the in the Icelands. But lucky for us, we have fish fingers, so this shouldn't be a challenge at all. All right, here we are, Nina. Here goes our third gym battle. All right, Nina has a pig knight. Honestly, pig knight is underrated. Nobody ever uses him. And maybe that's for a reason, because I think that he's gonna go down to one hit. Perfect. Now, last but not least, we have a heat more. And will it survive one hit? What do we think? Clearly not. Here, take the ember bag. Now, with the third gem badge in our case, I left the gem and ran into the professor. Do you want to come with me to catch the SS wake to Sabulo? Yes. Oh, I want to go foil some plot. Let's go find the Reggies. Great. Here we are. Just go into the port and you can board the SS wake to Sabulo. Wait, <laughs> how are we going to fit on the ship? That thing is tiny. You want to set sail for Sabulo Island? I mean, if we can fit. All right, all aboard the SS wake. Let's do this. Oh, check that out. Speedboat. Sabulo Tower. The secrets of mega evolution held within. Wait, there's mega evolution in this game. Yo! Oh, this tower is beautiful too. Let's go explore it. Now, this looks like the top of the tower. Now, let's go see what we have here. Welcome, trainer. My name is Successor Bell of Sabulo. This tower, when stood at the base, it appears to endlessly stretch to the skies. Truth, commitment, willpower. These qualities epitomize what it takes to reach the top. Indeed, they're also what a trainer needs to achieve mega evolution. You may therefore assume you are worthy, but that is false. You deserve nothing. Not yet. If you wish to unlock the true power of mega evolution, then defeat me in battle. Yes, please. Let's try this out. The hero crush should be easy enough. Yeah. Okay, we got a Sableye. Not too bad. Another flame wheel should take it down. Perfect. Wait, it has a <laughs> Mega Audino. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, Muck Punch does like nothing. What about a flame wheel? Please, maybe. Oh, he got burned though. Wait, <laughs> he missed that. We actually got a growl. And the 
the HM slave comes in handy. This is technically possible. We could get it, okay? If this hits, we win. Come on. Yes, I hit the bird. <laughs> we got it. Wait, there's more. Oh, she has a manic trick. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, we did it, finally. <laughs> I mean, first try. Yeah. So, do we just get Mega Evolution now? Wolf received the Mega Ring from Bell. Yo. So, I guess next up, we're gonna try and find a Pokemon to Mega Evolve. Wait, what? Another earthquake. Wait, is that the island with the Reggies? No. Are we too late? Yo, Reggie Rock. How did he fit through that door? Okay, come on. That's just unrealistic. Wolf. What was that explosion? Are you safe? It came from Sabulo Cave. If Sabulo Cave is in danger, that puts the tower at risk too. I can't risk abandoning my post. Woof. You've already demonstrated your prowess as a trainer. I trust that you can contain the situation. Go, be brave. I mean, that just sounds like she's scared, to be honest. But hey, I guess we'll go save the world or something. Yo, you seem to keep finding yourself involved with us, child. I have warned you once already. If you are here to interfere, you shall feel my wrath. Very well, these two will crush you. I have more pressing business to attend to. All right, that's the grunts done with. Fine, I'll crush you myself then. Ooh, <laughs> check out the fit though. This guy looks swaggy. Elder Knight Enoch, let's try this out. <laughs> How is this fair? I have a mushroom, he has a dinosaur. Aurora Beam is enough again, okay. It's not looking too bad so far. We can actually get this. Aerodactyl, okay. Fell on a good streak here. Oh no, he got the Omni Boost. Oh my word. Will Aurora Beam be enough though? Oh, I might not be anymore. Oh, oh well. Let's try this again. All right, no Omni Boost and this time it goes down. Okay. All right, one Pokemon left to go and it's a Gullurk. Okay, I think we have this. Please, be one hit, come on. All right, there it goes. And that is the win. In. This fight is irrelevant. Hey, this evolution is not irrelevant though. And just like that, we have a wall rain. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Enough games. Relic ball. Go. Relic ball. What? Did he just catch that guy first try? You'll regret meddling in our affairs. And they're gone. How are you gonna play happy music after that? Woof, are you okay? I saw everything. I would have helped, but well, it's kind of embarrassing. I just got my butt kicked by Sabulo Tower. But you were amazing out there. It's a shame the new elders got away. Hey, what do you have there? There. It's a map, right? Let me have a look at that. Look, there's a red cross on the map. That must be where they're headed next. Looks like we'll need Surf to get there, though. Well, consider today your lucky day. The chase continues. So, looks like I'll meet you at Valoon Town. There's another gym there, too. I wonder which one of us will get the badge first. See you later, Wolf. Thank you so much for dealing with that Sabulo Cave situation. You really do have a special bond with your Pokemon. For your help, I'd like to give you a reward on behalf of the entire island. It's a rare Pokemon holding a Mega Stone. Please take it. What? An Ivysaur! Yo! Do you want to give a nickname to Ivysaur? Yes, please. Hmm. This guy, I think, we'll call him Plant. If you train that Pokemon enough, it will evolve and be able to use its Mega Stone. You have potential for greatness, Woof. I'm glad my judgment was correct. Farewell and good luck. Thank you. I cannot wait to get some Mega Evolutions going on. With a team full of potential and a vast sea ahead of us, I hopped on the back of my wall rain and surfed down southwards. And it wasn't too long till I reached Valoon Way, where I was hit with another earthquake. But that didn't result in much, apart from an evolution from our monkey. I made it to Valoon Town shortly after, where something suspicious was going on. We need to go and check Nemesis Cave. People might have got hurt in the earthquake. Let's move out, team. Am I supposed to follow these guys? I mean, hey, let's go find out. Alright, let's see what's up here. It seems nobody got hurt in the earthquake, then. Oh, hey, look, another tablet. You, over there. I see you have found the Nemesis Cave tablet. We rangers have been investigating this tablet for some time, you know? We suspect it might be connected to the earthquakes that have been happening recently. There was an old legend which told of Pokemon which make these tablets glow a white color. We've tried bringing a Leap though and nothing happened. Anyways, I'm sorry to bore you. It's just nice to share information with a similarly curious mind. Oh, and you should come by the Rangers HQ later. We're gonna be hosting a bug catching contest. Please no. I'll see you there, trainer. I will not see you there. Are you sure it's here? Well, I sort of lost the map. I'm not sure where we are right now. Why didn't you say so then? I'm certain this isn't the right way. We should go back and check the other path. Sorry, Ezekiel, sir. So I guess they were trying to find this location, but since we have the map and they don't, they never made it here. I mean, I guess for now there's nothing left to do apart from taking on the fourth gym leader. But the door is locked <laughs> again. Do I have to enter the bug catching contest? Are you kidding me? As it's your first time, take these. We got the park balls. Let's go. So do I actually just gotta catch wheels? I mean, okay. That's one? Wait. Oh, wait. That's all. <laughs> uh, tabulation is finished. We can now reveal the scores. In third place with 206 points. It's Woof. <laughs> Woof has won one citrus berry. I mean, for a Weedle, honestly, that's 
that's not horrible. And Vernon won a Beedrillite. What? You can win Mega Stones from here. Thank you all for participating, and we hope to see you again. Yeah, no, no shot, dude. All right, and now we take on the gym. Let's see how this goes. All right, this should be the puzzle done with. No? Yep. Okay, there we go. Why, hey there. All right, let's try this out. No, not a shot goal. What are we ever gonna do? Wait, he just got a Beedrillite. Is he gonna Mega Evolve? Oh my god. Yo, the gym leaders can use Megas. <laughs> oh, that's so sick. And Flame Wheel is still enough for the one hit. I guess it didn't last for too long. And the gym battle is over. That's actually crazy, though. Woof, why do strangers keep barking? Wait, who's this? Oh, Bark. Anyways, looks like they're not letting people into the Telmerk swamp. Something about noxious gases. But lucky for you, I had the foresight to buy these. Here's yours. A gas mask. Cool. With these gas masks, we'll be able to get through. And maybe when we get to Telmerk City, we can battle again. I look forward to it. Later, Woof. Hey, a rival being useful for once. Look at that. Now, with my gas mask handy, I made it through the swamp without any issues. The water here did not look great, though. The water looks filthy. Would you like to surf? I mean, I guess we have to. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, Walrein. <laughs> After a while, I found Bark standing around in front of the Great Marsh, just talking to himself. Hey, what is Bark doing there? We're not gonna lose to Woof again, team. Aw, is he sad? Oh, you're here. This place is cool, isn't it? Maybe once we're finished helping the professor, we could take the battle marsh on. Anyways, I said we were gonna battle, and I meant it. No, Woof, I challenge you to a Pokemon battle. I'm gonna feel so bad for crushing this guy, but I don't think he stands much of a chance. And it's already over. Oh, I feel so bad. Ah, oh, I don't know how. Why does this? Oh, dude. Oh, I feel really bad. It's just, it's maddening, you know? I try to contain my anger, but losing is painful, all right? Oh, maybe I'm not cut out to be a Pokemon trainer after all. Let's go, Woof. So this is Telmerk. It looks huge, doesn't it? Oi. Nyah. I've never seen the two of yous. The name's Akuto. I run things here, like the big boss, you know? Me and my underlings, we run an organization, shall we say? We're known as the <laughs> We're known as the Mighty Mighty Yenas. Don't go interfering with our endeavors, kids. You might not like what you find. What's the worst thing these guys could be up to? I bet they resell glue. Don't talk out of line or you might be in deep trouble. Enjoy your stay. What a giga chat. He seemed kind of sketchy. <laughs> well, you don't say. Anyways, I'm gonna go ask around. Department store looks like a great place to start. Wait, what are we looking for? Let's see if we can gather any more info about the new elders. See ya, Wolf. Hey, Wolf. I've not heard anything useful yet. Keep looking, eh? So what? You're just gonna sit around being a lazy piece of garbage while I do all the work. Well, I guess I'm used to it at this point. There was nothing here. Aw. So I guess the department store was a bust. Listen, lady, I've been patient. I need the money, you hear? Cough it up. I, I don't have it, I swear. Why, I oughta. Oh, a trainer. Please, you have to help me. So you're gonna be a hero, eh, kid? All right then, bring it on. Who does this guy think he is? His head is literally so bald that even in a shadow it shines. Out of my way, kid. Akudo isn't gonna be happy when he hears about this. Oh, thank you so much. You're my hero. Let me heal your Pokemon. I sure hope somebody takes care of those thugs soon. Telmerk has gotten so dangerous ever since they got in power. Oh, so here's the big boss. What did I say about meddling in our affairs, kid? You've put me in a very difficult position. You, take him out. I don't think this is gonna work out. Akudo, I think you picked the wrong trainer to mess with. Nope, no chance. So what now, huh? You're both useless. Gotta do it myself then. Not the mightiest mighty mighty Anna. No, and it went down to. And that's Akudo done with. I'm speechless. What are you even doing in Telmer, kid? The new elders? Yeah, I've heard of them. They're a pain in my bottom line, shall we say? I'll tell my goons to let you into the gym. Peace out. <laughs> that sounds like a YouTube outro. This guy's got his life figured out. Still though, there's been nothing new about the new elders in this town. No clues, no nothing. But for now, let's take on the fifth gym. The Mighty Anna type gym. The sewage reeks. Would you like to surf? I mean, I have to. I don't want to. Of course the trainer here has a trash Pokemon. <laughs> what is this guy? Oh, what? Is that literally toxic waste? So this is how Pokemon Uranium started. Is this guy the gym leader? <laughs> He's cosplaying. How cute. Wait, what is that Pokemon supposed to be though? I don't even know. Oh wait, this, <laughs> this guy's the Arbok man. <laughs> His name is Sid the Arbok man. Let me show you how real justice feels. All right, Arbuck man, let's do this. If he doesn't have six Arbucks, I'll be very disappointed. Arbuck, okay, we like it. Wait, that's not an Arbuck. Aw, wait, he's a Mega Venusaur. What? Yo, this guy's falling. Yeah, okay, we need to be way more prepared. Let's try it again. Okay, let's see how much a flame wheel does. Please, Venusaur. That's like nothing. What? No, I got poisoned. Okay, let's try it again, again. Yeesh, you look like you took a beating. Let me heal your cutie Pokemon. <laughs> okay, at least the nurse is nice. Even though she did roast me. Please let me live. Come on. Okay, I think it's over. I think we finally got it. Oh, we did it. Yes. Oh, GG. And that is our fifth gym badge. That took a while. Well played, team.
Oh, woof, perfect timing. Come help me out. This mighty Anna dude here. He says he has valuable information about the new elders, but he refuses to talk. Wait, did he say woof? Yeah, you're the kid that took down Akudo. P please don't hurt me. I'll tell you everything I know. I overheard them new oldens or whatever talking about Reggie Steele. Says they're headed to some cave north of the city to awaken it. They said it was the Friar Runes. Sparrow Runes. Yeah, that was it. Anyways, they were rambling about some new world order stuff. Then some dude in silver, like the big bus, appeared. He said a few things and then they all left in a big hurry. And that's all I know, I swear. Fur ruins, right? I saw that on my town map. It's north of here, so we just go through the underground path, and I'll meet you there then. Don't take forever, all right? All right, Bark, I'll see you soon. Wait, they have Reggie Ice, they have Reggie Rock, and if they get this, they have all three. So after that, is it Reggie Gigas? Or are those three enough to control the earthquakes? Or are they gonna awaken Reggie Gigas using those guys? I mean, hey, only one way to find out, so let's waste no time and get to that right now. He said use the underground path, which is right here. Now let's leave Telmer. Wait, is this the same one from Kanto? I swear it is. Oh, wait, Herschel. Wait, we've met before. You're Charles's aide, right? Say, you're not the same trainer who helped Bell at Sabulo. Oh, you are? Astounding. Charles has recruited quite the prodigy. I knew those new elders were up to no good. Now, I must dash. All right, sir. It's actually cool. I think this is the first ROM hack I've played where they actually added new HMs. Because this is a ROM hack of Fire Red, but they still have Rock Climb, which I think is sick. Oh, wait, here we are. This is the cave, I think. Yeah, Fur Ruins. Okay. Yep, it's full of these guys. So, hey, at least we're in the right place. Look, we're gonna keep going but i have a feeling that we're once again just too late and after pushing through deep into the cave i found the new elder boss ezekiel waiting for me at the bottom you must be the vigilante child i was warned about you're an aide to professor redwood correct how saddening one would think someone with his smarts would understand our aims a shame indeed you see these are not the actions of some cult we are merely accelerating the plans of nature herself the elders of orbis understood the sanctity of our culture in fact this very chamber was designed by the elders and what fantastic architects they were. It will take a millennium for you to break through this wall. The wall has a contraption with numbers on it. Try and solve it? Yeah? <laughs> I don't speak braille. What does that mean? Oh, so there's only 10,000 combinations. That shouldn't take too long. Right? <laughs> Let's get to work. So with my magical skills, I think I can guess this answer right. Oh, we're gonna go with 4519. Yeah. Yes? Please? Wolf pushed the lock. Hey, a doorway was revealed. See, I didn't even have to Google that. I was just a gamer. That was a gamer moment. Impressive, perhaps Perhaps I underestimated you. You did not quite take a millennium. Yeah, I did not. Nevertheless, I now have what I came for. Wait, he already has Registeel, and now I'll crush you. Bruh, are we too late again? I guess we'll just try and take him out for now. Yo, he's a mega agron. Oh, that's sick. Oh, but it doesn't look like it's gonna live for long now, because down it already goes. This is his last Pokemon, but there is still no Registeel here. But I assume he has it caught anyways. I wonder why he doesn't use them. You're just a speed bump in our plans. We've achieved every single one of our goals, despite your child efforts to stop us. The new elders will bring this putrid world to its knees. And here's a promise, kid. Once Registeel fully awakens, you'll be the first to feel my wrath. You will rue this day. Oh, so he didn't catch Registeel, but he got something to awaken it, maybe? There you are. I just saw the new elders leaving. Okay, wait, 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 wait. How is he always first to get the gym badge? But anytime there's actual trouble or danger going on, he always somehow ends up being late. Hmm, Bark, are you... Is there something you're not telling me? I missed out on all the sweet wolf action again. Stop the lies. You're digging your own grave here. Did you hear about Presimo's Island's new gym leader? In fact, you could probably be the new champ if you tried. You just need three more badges at this point, right? I'll catch you in Presimo's Island. Bye. All right. See, he's already gone. I bet he's already there. I bet he has a gym badge already. But anytime where it actually matters, he's like, oh, I'm sorry I was late. Oh, bark. Uh, I guess we'll take it on. Oh, this guy has swag. Leader will. Let's do this. Satu. Interesting choice. Don't think it'll live for long, but hey, nice try. Yo, wait, what? He has a mega slow, bro. Wait, all the leaders have megas. Oh, that's so cool. I can't wait to get our Venusaur. And uh, there we go. Player defeated leader will. Please accept this focus patch. I sure will, pal. Thank you. So if I'm not mistaken, that is badge number six. So two more to go. But there's still a lot of mystery in this region. So I didn't know what to do after getting the sixth gym badge. But after wandering around town, I found myself at Presimo's hotel, where I found what I thought was some new elders acting suspicious. All right, we'll take you on. <gasps> Yo, we're getting a Venusaur. And guys, you know what that means? That means not only are we getting a Venusaur, but we're getting a Mega Venusaur. Oh, yeah. That's a massive win. G got a dash. All right, see you, dude. Wait, are these new elders? I don't actually know. Oh, wait, are these guys burglars? Oh, are they robbing the place? Oh, I see. Teehee. <laughs> Remember to delete your history, kids. I don't even want to know what this guy found. I don't even want to think of all the guard wars on that computer. We'll <laughs> leave him alone in there. Wait, 
That's a tablet idol, it's one of many actually. The story goes that the tablets around the region react to a special metal inside the idols. I'm supposed to deliver this one to the at sale city lab. I'm not gonna let work interrupt my vacation though. I paid extra for this luxury suite. Was I? You deliver it for me? Well, how's a man meant to turn down an offer like that? So I guess this is what the rubbers wanted, and I'd guess that the new elders hired them to do that. But why did they want this? Hell, I've got some important zeds to go catch up on. <laughs> Back to sleep he goes. Uh, now he is living the life. That is a giga chat. Oh, woof, over here. Why is he sitting with a little child? This is the life, isn't it? Just relaxing on the beach. Well, not anymore. We've got work to do. We should be training, remember? Let's battle. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Awesome. Well, that didn't go so well, did it? I mean, hey, maybe one day he'll beat me. I'm not crying. There's sand in my eyes. <laughs> no excuses, right? Why don't we relax a little bit? Those diving tours just opened up. What do you say? Wanna give him a shot? I'll take your unwavering silence as a yes, as you should, my friend. See you there, slowpoke. But before we go there, what is this guy doing? Is he covered in sand? Do you mind? I'm trying to get a tan. What on earth is going on there? <laughs> Anyways, let's go on a diving tour. Is she gonna teach me how to use dive? <laughs> <laughs> glug 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 <laughs> Translated This is so cool Woof Glug 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 We should duel After leaving my diving group I probably wandered off too far Because I ended up in Ida Shore Reach And eventually stumbled into the cosmic caverns It's starting Come on out It's starting Wait what is starting Where am I What is this place Come on we don't want to miss it Guys what is it Let me know Ooh okay A gathering Welcome to the 200th annual meteor festival Only a few generations ago Ago, the very land we stood on was plummeting through space. The Ida Shore Clefairy will perform the meteor dance as is tradition. Wait, that Clefairy kind of looks like the one from earlier, from the start of the run, in that one very special cave. I wonder. Anyways, let us watch in reverence. Whoa, that is beautiful. That is... wow. Oh, Clefairy, why have you halted? What? And it's gone. Clefairy, why have you abandoned us? Yo! <laughs> That's a big earthquake. Oh dear. Perhaps the Clefairy had a premonition of this earthquake. Such an event must have frightened it off. This is the worst festival ever. You suck, old man. <laughs> Ouch! This blows. Boo! All this hype for nothing. I'm out of here. Me too. Well, that was a bit rude, don't you say? Everyone left. My reputation as an elder is going downhill. But you're still here, though. You wouldn't be interested in helping out an old man, would you? I have countless tomes in the Ida Shore Clefairy. Come with me to my house so we can plan how to get it back. The book on Clefairy's origins. Let's take a look. And research indicates the Clefairy retreat to the impact site. The specific whereabouts of this location, however, is unknown. Or is it? So maybe Maybe it is in the cave where we first found it, at the very start of our adventure. This explains why our Clefairy fled, but it doesn't mention where it would have retreated to. The legends state the cosmic caverns were once meteors. Perhaps that's because they're the original point of impact. I think they should be the first place you look. I do want to go explore that very first town though. Okay, so we're supposed to go to the cosmic caverns, but honestly, I do want to go explore that very first cave. Okay, here we are. Come on, Clefairy. Oh, oh okay. Nope, let's go all the way back. Okay, so there is something else in cosmic caverns. Maybe the Clefairy is here. Oh, Oh, there we go. Hello there. Oh, <laughs> what? It just threw me up. Can we go back? The fairy. And now, <laughs> now it left. Oh, it's a puzzle. Okay. So I guess we gotta try and get the Clefairy out of this cave. Oh, so we gotta approach Clefairy from the back. There we go. I think we've got it cornered. Hello there, Clefairy. Booey poo. Hey, it agreed to come home. Welcome back, everybody. Thanks for the brave efforts of Woof. The show can go on. Now let's try this again. Okay, do your little dancey dance. Amazing. I think Clefairy could win America's Got Talent, honestly. I was mad, but that was so worth it. Oh, yeah. I can't ever repay you enough, but I do hope you accept this gift. It was handed down to me by my father. Here with your very own Master Ball. Oh, perfect. If I were you, I would save the Master Ball for a very special Pokemon. But I'm sure a talented trainer like yourself will know when the time is right to use it. Oh, hey, look at Delibird. You know what? I think I want to catch it. Let's go for it. Three, two, one. Yes, there we go. We caught a Delibird. Beautiful. With Father Christmas safely inside my box, I crossed the Gyarados Bridge and ended up in Atsail City where I was supposed to return that tablet's idol. And after talking to some scientists, I found out she was the gym leader. And with that information, I'm sure you guys know what's about to happen next. Next. Hello there, Marina. Yo, wait, what? I forgot. We have Mega Evolution. Yes. Oh, but he's a poison type. Oh, boring. We'll try it out soon. All right, now it is time for a Mega Evolution. Our Venusaurite is reacting to Wolf's Mega Ring. Come on. Oh, let's go. Now, let's see if we can one hit. I'd be very surprised if we get it. There we go. Yo, this is crazy. Oh, wait. We even
doing with the Kingdra too. Oh, that's perfect. Gyarados, okay. This could be a bit harder, actually. Oh, wait. Oh, she has Megas too. I forgot. Wait, that makes life easier. Oh, wait, but Petal Dance is super effective too. Oh, let's go. Come on, big win. Wait, no way. Yo, our Venusaur got the whole gym. <laughs> yes, let's go. Well done, dude, for real. Player defeated Leader Marina. And that is our seventh gym badge. Nice. Now, what is it you want to discuss with me? Matters relating to the tablet idol. I see. Meet me at Atse Laboratory and we'll talk there. Have you got the tablet idol? I sure do. Thank you. We've been waiting for this delivery for a while. That Redwood card. You know Charles. Of course, you're woof. He told me how you witnessed the awakening of Reggie Rock. We've been collaborating on this earthquake issue, and I suppose I should explain why we need this tablet idol. Walk with me. This machine can detect and recreate the energy from Pokemon moves. Think of, say, Hyper Beam. It's a devastating move. When a Pokemon fires it at a wall, there will be residue left over. This machine can find even the slightest trace of this energy. Our hypothesis is that the tablet idol is connected to the tablets, but on its own, nothing happens. It needs a catalyst to activate, and that's why we think a powerful Pokemon move is necessary. Of course, the issue is determining which one. I'll leave the idol with my staff to analyze further. Oh no. Wait, she's leaving the tablet here. It's so gonna get stolen, isn't it? It is so gonna get stolen, mark my words. And tell it to the rest of your buddies too. Great timing, Woof. Did you see me totally wreck that new Elder Grunt? He was acting suspicious outside the at sale cold storage. When I asked him what he's doing, he bolted. Then we had a Pokemon battle and I totally beat him. Anyways, I think we should go check that place out. Who knows what those thugs are up to now? I'll see you there, okay? Hey, there you are. We need to find a key for this forklift. They could have hidden it anywhere. I have a feeling it won't be in this room though. It must be somewhere close to the city. Man, this is gonna be like finding a needle in a haystack. Is that a clue? Maybe? Please? Now, if I was a haystack, where would I be? Maybe in Lomas Fields. I mean, field sounds good. Oh, hey, look. How convenient, guys. A haystack. I guess time to start hunting. Not here. Oh, hey, a forklift key. Well, that wasn't so bad. And we are back. Whoa, you managed to get the key. You're amazing, Wolf. Let's convince this guy to move for us so we can find out what's really going on here. All right, what is going on down here? Do you hear that? There must be people down here. Let's try our best to keep quiet. I don't even know where I am. Okay, let's go hide behind these crates will be an earshot. Oh, what? I think we've waited long enough. The public are close to finding out the cause of the earthquakes. If we wait any longer, we'll miss our opportunity. Please, Morgana, let's move into the final phase. Know your place, Enoch. You do not give me orders. Were it not for your collective incompetence, the plan would be going far smoother. However, I agree that it's time we accelerate our plan. Eunice, you say that Red Ice has fully left its dormant state. Yes, ma'am. I can prepare for the mission right away. That's good news. And what of Reggie Steel, Azik? Kill. Still dormant, but it is not needed for now. We should go ahead while we still have the element of surprise. We've all had run-ins with those two kids that Professor Redwood has been working with. We should be ready for them. Agreed. It baffles me that the three of you lost to a child. If they get in the way again, I'll destroy them myself. Yo, who is this grandma? Gather the resources. We'll begin the final phase at Ignis Roost. Yes, ma'am. The retirement home called. Wait, is he gonna spot us? No, please. Must be a Rattata or something. Oh my word, okay. He almost got us there. Oh no! Whatever the final phase means, it doesn't sound good. Let's get out of here, woof. There you are. Woof. Bark. <laughs> Why did I pick these names? This is my good friend Marina. Bark told us what you two overheard in there. All the elder knights were there. They answered to some old lady, Morgana. That name doesn't ring a bell. Me neither. What, woof? You met her in Reliquia Ruins. Wait, is that the old lady from the start of the run? Is she who took my book? Yo, what? She took your book? Yeah, that's her. We should pursue them to the Apex Temple. I agree. Woof. We may well be headed to danger. Do you want me to come now? You know what? Let's go, let's do this. Whoa, this place wasn't snowy before. Weird, I thought this peak was above the clouds. Wait, could Reggie Ice be behind this? Let's head to the temple. I cannot agree with you anymore. And here we are, back at the Zatu Tower. It's breathtaking, it is. Yeah, maybe the new elders are... Wait, that's her! That's Morgana! Eunice, Enoch, and Ezekiel were right then. You followed us. No doubt to try and interfere. How unfortunate for you then, that this was a mere ruse. And now, I will put an end to your meddling myself. Yo, what? No way, what? We're battling Morgana! You are challenged by Elder Sage Morgana. Alright, I mean, let's go for it. Miss Magius. Well, come on, we have plants. And nothing. Look at me, nothing beats plants. Now let's go for a pedal dance. Alrighty, there goes Miss Magius. 
guess. Next up is Gengar, but we should still be fine. Yo, she has a Mega Gengar! <laughs> I should have seen that coming at this point, but still, every time it just surprises me. Oh man, I love Megas. Okay, will a Flame Wheel even do any damage at this point? Oh, that's- Oh, and he got burned! Perfect. And there goes. We have Drapion. There it goes. And last but not least, we have a Houndoom. So I will call this game over. Rather impressive, I must admit. Thank you. I see now how my Elder Knights lost to you, child. Nevertheless, I have brought them enough time. No, the prize should be ours now. What is the prize? Wait, that's the lab. What did I say? <laughs> the scientist had it. Take the tablet, idol. What did I say earlier? Oh my god. Oh, these guys are so dumb. Regigigas will be ours. No, the tablet idol. And now this shall be your tomb. The exit has been collapsed. I wish you luck in your escaped attempt. Futile though it may be. Farewell. Wait, how did she get out of here? What do you mean? Come on now, there must be some secret exit or something around here. The elders of Orbis love that kind of stuff. Morgana must have got out somehow. You're right, let's get looking. Okay, if I was a secret exit, where would I be? Ah, oh, sorry Woof, I was lost in my thoughts again. Don't you think this pillar is suspicious? If you peek through the cracks, there's a room behind here. Huh, I know. I'll use my Gyarados' strength to get us through. Hey, there we go. Well, looks like we found our escape. Nice work, Marina, and Woof. Shall we head down, Marina? Well, not to be rude, but Charles, you don't have any Pokemon. Maybe you should wait up here. It could be dangerous. Woof and I should go ahead first. Mark could stay here to keep you company too. Hey, why am I on daycare? What happened to your optimism? If Woof or I get harmed, we'll need your healing items, silly. That's why you should stay behind. It's a very important job. Let's go, Woof. You were Marina acting kind of sus, not gonna lie. Okay, Ignis Catacombs. Now let's see what we have down here. Hmm, it's blocked off, but there's a path past here. Ooh, what? <laughs> what is this? Yo, uh, why is it foggy in here now? A strange compulsion to touch the statue overwhelms Woof. What? Wait. What? We found it! A wild ridge gig has appeared! What? What? Wait, what's going on? <laughs> How did we get a Ranger Rock? What? No, is this a dream or what? Wait, that's an earthquake. Okay, let's get a hammer arm. But they had Ranger Rock, not me. What was that? Woof, are you okay? I heard a weird noise. When I found you, you were here, eyes firmly shut. It's like you were in a trance. The statue must have some weird properties. Do they already have Regigigas? Are we too late? What else is in this cave? At this point, do I even want to know? Wait, the fuck again? Another statue. So what, we're gonna be Reggie Ice now. Or Reggie Steel. Reggie Ice, okay. Same moveset. And down it goes. The strange aura of the statue now seems inert. But where are the bad guys? Where are we? What? Oh wait, and here is another one. What, Reggie Steel? Yeah? Okay. And that should be it too. That's the third time? Third time is the charm? So what, we just head deeper and deeper into this cave. An exit. Hey Woof, there we are. You must have got split up along the way. It looks like you found the way out though, right? I can smell the fresh air from here. Where are we? This must be Ignis Valley. I don't think we have much time to explore, sadly. Charles is right. It's urgent that we head back to Atsail City. The new elders may have the tablet idle, but they don't know how to use it. At least for now. That gives us the advantage, if only for a little while. Now, onto the matter at hand. The new elders have captured all three Titan Pokemon. However, the Titans are only one piece of the puzzle. The elders of Arborist shield Regigigas away with some of the most complex engineering ever. Luckily, our analysis of the idol completed before they got here. And that means that we managed to determine what move activates the idol. And that move is... Molten Rays. Haven't heard of that one before. It's a rare move that few trainers have ever mastered. In fact, I know only of one man to ever have taught the move to their Pokemon. None other than the current champion of the Orbis League. Hersh- what? Herschel? He's a champion. I did not see that coming. That's such a plot twist. Yes, he's quite the recluse. Herschel didn't even want the post of champion. He has a strict policy of not interfering with politics. It's unlikely he will want to fight the new elders himself, but if we want any chance to stop the new elders, we'll need to learn Molten Rays. Woof, you already have seven gym badges. That means you only need one more before you can face Herschel. The final gym is in Lomas Town, and that's north of here. Mark, what should I do, Doc? I wanna help? Well, I'm sure Charles could use a hand. Sifting through all of those books in Salanto Library can't be easy. Well, it's not as glamorous as Woof's job, but I'll do anything to help. For us, that only means one thing, and that means that north we go. Now, I started my journey to Loa Mass Town, and it wasn't too long before I made it there. And like I was told earlier, the only thing left for me to do at this point is to beat the 8th gym leader. So, of course, that's exactly what I did. Alrighty then, this is our final gym challenge. Richter, let's go. Hippowdon. Okay, I'm 
willing to make a bet. I will literally release every single shiny Pokemon I have in Pokemon Legends Arceus if I don't one-shot every single one of his teammates. Let's try this out. All right, Surf. Easy. That's another one-hit. Let's use a Surf. Nobody saw that. It's a one-hit. Totally. It was a one-hit. Doug Trio. What? That's not even a ground type. Wait, okay, I didn't think that was a Dodrio. No, it wasn't me. Anyways, Surf should take it out. And last but not least, we have a Garchomp. Of course. I forget every time, but it's a Mega. Yo, let's go. Worst Mega Pokemon ever. Mega Garchomp. And he missed. Okay. Honestly, Aurora Beam will be an easy one hit. Give it to us. Come on. There we go. Well, Battle Challenger, thank you. So we now have eight badges. That's it. So I guess now we go and find Herschel. So what? Do we head to the Pokemon League? I guess that's what we're going to do. Now, this was no easy task. I traveled through this scorching hot desert, and clearly not everybody makes it through here. Ouch, that is tough. But somehow, our rival did. And hey, we have Mark. Hey, I see you've got Richter's tectonic badge. I got bored helping the professor, so I decided to try myself. Let's just say the gym challenge isn't for me. What? The first game where your rival actually doesn't get eight badges. Aw, it makes me feel kind of bad now. Say, while we're here, how about a battle for old time's sake? Okay. This time will be different, I promise. Bro. Oh, you couldn't beat the 8th gym. I don't think it'll be any different. Hey, I mean, he has a Mega. That's something, I guess. Or, well, he had a Mega. Because that thing is done for. So it wasn't that different now, was it, huh? Wow, being less invested in winning actually made that way more fun. Anyways, the professor found some useful info at the Cilantro Library. Apparently, there is something called a Key Tablet. And guess where it's located? Ignis Valley. The new elders will probably be trying to get the Key Tablet. Let's beat them to the punch, eh? See you in Eco's Town, Slowpoke. Ecos Town looks to be pretty close to here. And here we are, Ecos Town, the last stop before the league. Oh wait, Ignis Valley, that's the place, yeah. Oh, here he is. Hello, Bark. Hey, Woof, this is Herschel's house. If he's the one who knows Molten Rays, we should ask for help. And we can go get the key tablet in Ignis Valley. Are you ready to go ask for his help? Yeah, why not? Ah, hello, just one moment. Why, it's Charles's aides. Uh, uh, Bark. And his friend, Woof. Ah, uh, yes, Woof and friend. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't even acknowledge, Bark. What brings you to Ecos Town? I see, you seek the power of Molten Rays. I'm afraid my answer is the same as it was for the new elders when they asked. And that answer is no. But it was nice to see you, kids. What? So is that it? We just don't get to... <laughs> Imagine the plot ends here, like the whole game is over. Please, do not pester me on this topic. Both yourselves and the new elders want this power for your goals. And that is a fundamental misunderstanding of our relationship with Pokemon. I will not endorse the misuse of Pokemon for the agendas of humans. Cringe. Well, that went horribly. Yeah. If he refuses to listen to reason, we'll have to do this ourselves. At the very least, we can slow the new elders down. Yo, that's another earthquake. That was a big one, yeah. Felt like it came from Ignis Valley. All right, here we are. Ignis Catacombs. Wait. Wait, this is where we came from, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Aw, the good old days. But where are we going to now? Oh, looks like we found the bad guys. At last, the key tablet. Yo, that's a ho-oh. Uh, sculpture. Whatever it was called. I am proud of you all. My children, I imagine you wish to witness the awakening firsthand. It would be the greatest honor of all. Well, I'm afraid you shan't be here for it. It is imperative the other tablets are guarded. I would trust nobody more than my three elder knights to do so. But ma'am, my decision is final. Now go. She just ditched them. The time has finally come. Regigigas, your slumber is over. Not so fast, because we are here to save the day. We're not gonna let you destroy our home. Enough, I'm sick of your interference. I'll crush you petulant children once and for all. That's what you said last time. Just saying. Oh, and last but not least, we have Salamence. Honestly, I think we have this. Wait, she has Molten Rays. What? How did she learn that? Wait, so if she beats us, it's over. Wait, we have it. Oh my god, we have a max revive. Oh, that's all. Lifesaver because I think that fish finger were faster, so I think I'm ninety percent sure this will be a one hit. Let's go! Come on, we got it. Perfect. Poetic. The old lady defeated by a child. I don't think that's very poetic. That just sounds rude. Haha, -ha, that's what I'm talking about. Nice going, Woof. But her Salamence. Yes? My Salamence does indeed know Molten Rays. But that's impossible. Only Herschel knows how to use it. And there is no way he teach you the move either. Don't believe everything you read. The elders of Orbis detailed the technique in an ancient tome. In fact, it was the very same tome Woof had at the start. So I literally could have saved the entire world if I just didn't give her that stupid book. 
Of course, it should have never ended up in Salento Library. There's no telling what could have happened if it fell into the wrong hands. But as fate would have it, the book and the tablet idol found their way to me. Quite the act of providence, wouldn't you agree? I think it's proof that the universe endorses my goal. But enough chatter. The age of the new elders is here. Salamance, consume this revival herb. Now, summon the power of molten rays. Fire onto the tablet idol and break the elder's seal. Yo, wait, what? She, she, she did it. But where did she go? And where's Regigigas? And why is the tablet glowing? Woof, Bark, please accept my apologies. This is all my fault. I shouldn't have underestimated the new elders, and I should have trusted you. With the key tablet activated, the entire region is in jeopardy. I owe you both an explanation. Please, let's talk at my home. Why is there happy music? <laughs> no. Morgana used molten rays on the tablet idol, correct? She will have been transported to the chamber of Gaia. Is that where Regigigas is? It is a prison engineered by the elders of Arbus. Its purpose is to keep the legendary Regigigas dormant. And they built it to protect Arbus from the earthquakes Regigigas brought upon it many years ago. Now normally the chamber is inaccessible. When the seal is broken, the key tablet transports the tablet idol's holder to the chamber. So how can we chase Morgana if she's got the tablet idol? That's a good question. She doesn't have the only one. Wait, there's more than one tablet idol. If my info is correct, yes. Legend has it, there are three separate pieces of a second tablet idol. We can somehow find these pieces and rebuild it. Well, we'll at least have some chance at stopping Morgana. Wait, I think I know where the pieces will be. The other three tablets. It was in a book the professor made me read. Woof, we've gotta recover the three idol pieces. Alakazam here can teleport you to the tablets. Time is of the essence, and in the meantime, I'll dig up my research on Regigigas. If it is unleashed onto Orbis again, we'll need to know how to stop its rampage. I'll go find the professor. Alright, let's go. No time to waste. Alright, Alright, so it is elder slaying for now, but hey, let's see how it goes. Okay, I have a feeling my fish finger is kind of overleveled because these guys are dropping like flies. Ooh, Mega Bumba Snow, that's actually really cool. Wait, he might take me down. Oh, wow. Oh, that actually did more damage to him than me. I mean, hey, that's perfect because now I can take it down. Then we have a Frostlass. Well, we had a Frostlass. Okay, that's the last Pokemon now, a Nuxile. If we're faster, we get the win. Please, come on, let's get it. Nice, we got it. Two more to go. Wait, we just let him go. I guess we'll get the rest of the tablets now. All right, here is Enoch for our second battle. Yo, Mega Herodactyl, what? Thing is, I'm one-shotting everybody. This is a bit too easy. Honestly, I somehow picked the best Pokemon possible for this. Fishfinger, you are goaded. There we go. That's the second elder. And Nemesis Cave. Here should be the final one. Here Ezekiel is. It seems you've a knack for escaping traps. But this time, there will be no trickery. I will bear you outright. Let's see about that, Ezekiel. And once again, it is done for. No, I needed Registeel to win. Morgana should not have taken the Titans. I can't just stay here. I need to go help the others. Wait, I, I took them all down, but where did they go? Wait, oh, oh, the idle pieces are behind the tablets. I see, okay. So that's one. So here should be the second one. Perfect, okay. And the final one, the Tangrowth tablet. Third and last idle piece. And yet another massive earthquake. Okay, let's go back to Herschel's and see what's up. You have retrieved all three idol pieces. Incredible work, Woof. Hand them over, I will try and reconstruct the tablet idol. And there we go. I have news of my own. In my research, I have discovered something important. The elders of Orbis implemented one final failsafe, a last-ditch effort for containing Ridge Gigas's rage. However, well, this is the bad part. It's all the way in Kato Surf Island. That means, in other words, only one of us can chase Morgana. And now I know this is a lot to ask, but you have a lot of experience with the new elders, and I cannot think of a better candidate for facing Morgana. And after all, you've defeated her twice already, correct? Time is of the essence. You have the remade tablet idol and you have my trust. Now, would you like to leave for Ignis Valley? I guess this is it. Good, we should spare no time. And this is it, Woof. Once the tablet idol activates and the key tablet transports you, there is no telling what you'll find on the other side. I only wish I could go in your place. Are you ready? Salamence. No, good luck, Woof. Salamence, use molten rays. We're in the chambers of Gaia. Your persistence astounds me. It's almost admirable. The world would benefit from more people exhibiting such qualities, but unfortunately, we have collectively lost our way. Modernity is a plague on humanity and Pokemon alike. We keep ourselves distracted with pointless frivolities. Pokemon contests, Pokemon battles, even the Pokemon League, it's all useless. It demeans the majesty of Pokemon. But there was a time it was different. The elders of Orbis revered Pokemon. They respected Pokemon for the magnificence they are. Pokemon weren't merely pets to whom you teach measly tricks. But today, and here, I will force the modern world to respect Pokemon 
once again. Rigigigas will bring Orbis to its knees, where we belong. You, however, will not witness this new world. Consider this mercy. I guess this is our third battle, and the third time is the charm. Alright, Houndoom is up next, and we're gonna go for a Surf. Nice, perfect. Ah, Drapion, we should still be fine. Now there we go. And now it's time for Mega Gengar, level 57. We really gotta hope this works out. Here we go, Mega Venusaur versus Mega Gengar. Wait, withdrew Gengar and sent out Siegelith. Interesting choice, that's actually really good for us. Because now we can take it out with an Aurora Beam. And now, Mega Gengar versus Fishfinger, who will save the world? Let's find out. Wait, I thought you had the Regis though. Am I missing something here? I don't know, let's go for a Surf. Oh, it's enough, yes! We did it! I can't be too happy though, I this can't be it. What about the Regis? What about Regi Ice, Regi Rock, Regi Steel, Regi Gigas? That's it, you have forced my hand. Fine, I was hoping I'd defeat you and give you a chance to run to your mother for the end, but you refuse to go home and this leaves me no choice. You shall be Regigigas' first victim. There they are! Regirock, lend me your strength. Regiice, awaken once more. Registeel, forbear yourself no more. In the presence of the Titans three, Regigigas, end your slumber. Oh, <laughs> this is so much cooler than the Ice Temple in Sinnoh. With the Titans and Regigigas, I am unstoppable. I'll make you wish our paths never crossed, once and for all. Yo, <laughs> this is it. Everybody's dead. So it's my fish finger versus Regirock, Regiice, Registeel, Regigigas. And I'm out of PP on my best move. Okay, Regirock, that should be a one hit. Okay, we're not giving up yet. Okay. Okay, we're gonna use an elixir on fish finger get some pp wait we actually have a we actually have a shot at this unless she has a full restore we actually could get this it's faster that wasn't too bad no surf did just too much damage she's gonna full restore or not fish finger you surf we're low on health but it is not over next up is red ice we only have two pokemon left to go and pelipper is pretty much useless but we can still heal this is basically our last safe heal to go charge beam that is the end of us 100 percent we're on to our last pokemon fish Fishfinger, can you save the world or not? Come on, this is it. Fishfinger used surf. Fingers crossed. Please, 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 please. I did nothing. It has amnesia. I could use dive. <laughs> I'm really desperate here. I'm gonna Google the stats, actually. Oh, wait. Its special defense is super high. But its defense is half of that. So dive technically. Okay. Technically, it's possible. Okay, Fishfinger, this is it. Ah, so close. Amnesia, what? What is it doing? Come on, yes, let's go. Come on. Only Registeel left to go. Elder Sage Morgana sent out Registeel. So this guy is an all-around tank, but I think we did it. I think we did it. How did we do that with literally just Fishfinger? What a goaded Pokemon. I, I still lost? All my life dedicated to this moment, only to be usurped by a child. Were the Elders of Orbis wrong? We did it. Yo! Regigigas is rampant. Paging. Yes, I will still win. The Titans fled. Okay, I would too, to be honest. What? 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 What happened? Where did the Titans go? Why is Regigigas dormant again? What? What did you do? Woof, thank goodness you're safe. It's over, Morgana. The Titans have fled and Regigigas is dormant once more. Uh, how? What What did you do? I stopped Regigigas' rampage using the power of the Kato Surf Lock. You claim to be serving the interest of the elders, but you know nothing of them. And this is why I denied you Nis at the museum. You are simply deranged for Fanatics, and the universe didn't choose you for anything. Woof, I hope this makes up for my ignorance. You have proven yourself more times than anybody could have asked for. Thank you for your service. Come, let us leave this place. This isn't over. The universe chose me. Words can't express my gratitude, Woof. The bravery you've exhibited is nothing short of heroic. I certainly won't be forgetting your name anytime soon. With the Titan sealed away and Morgana behind bars, Arbus is finally safe. Of course, the Elder Knights are missing in action, but without a unifying leader, I suspect their infighting will be their downfall. Plus, let's just say I've deployed, well, an exorbitant amount of security at the Kato Surf Lock. And with that said, I believe one final challenge awaits you, and that is the Pokemon League, of course. Don't think your political endeavors gives you a free pass. I will meet you at the peak of Victory Falls, and I suppose you'll need this to get there. Waterfall, awesome. That HM, of course, contains Waterfall. I eagerly await your challenge. Good luck, Woof. I missed the action again, didn't I? <laughs> I finally got the 8th gym badge, and you know what that means, right? I'm gonna follow you to the Pokemon League. Or rather, you're gonna follow me! Catch you at the top, Slowpoke! Just like the good old days. Alright, let's go finish this run off. Let's go challenge the Pokemon League. I scaled massive waterfalls, traversed the victory road, but before entering the league, I had one final challenge. Hey, Woof, we're finally here! The Pokemon League! This climb is really a sight for sore eyes, isn't it? Well, a promise is a promise. As we said, we were gonna battle, and that 
wasn't a lie. Come on, Wolf, give me all you've got. Okay, one last time for the road. Let's do it. Go get Galith too. Okay, I don't know how we've done this, but we might actually get the win. If we can take down Leafeon... That's Swords Dance. But I used the next defense, so technically we could get it. Swords Dance twice. Okay, that's that's not fair. <laughs> we did it with one Pokemon left at 45 health. And there goes our rival. Sure, you won, but didn't I give you a run for your money? Well, you actually did. Well played. I have mad respect for that. Let me, let me be the first to call it. You're gonna be the new champion. Uh, don't tell Herschel I said that. And good luck on your league challenge, Wolf. Now, with Bark out the way, there's only one thing left for me to do, and that is to become champion. Alrighty, this is it. We are a champion Herschel himself for our final challenge. Ah, uh, right on time, Wolf. Come, let's skip the pleasantries. We both know each other, all that matters is the battle. Give me all you've got, I will not hold back. Let's do this. Wait, he kind of looks like Drayden, to be honest. Okay, away, Lord. Respectable. Okay, let's see how much a pedal dance does on his way. Hey, Lord, come on. Oh, we got it. What? That's crazy. I'm most swine. Uh, uh, I think we got a one shot with this. I think it's double. Come on. Fingers crossed, please. Can we plant him up? Oh, not even close. Anyways, this should do the job. There it goes. Memo Swine. Ayan Mega. No wonder you couldn't save the world. Let's hit an Aurora Beam and take it out. Nice try. And a Tang Growth. What is this team? I mean, the Tang Growth at least survived one hit, but it's not gonna survive much more. Because last but not least, we have an Alakazam. It's not gonna Mega Evolve. Okay. Anyways, that did like no damage. But a Surf, however, this will hit hard. Come on. Ah, oh, so close. Come on, let's finish this. Off. Let's become champion of the Orbis region. Come on, Surf. This is it. Come on. We did it, guys. We did it. Oh, wait, what? Salamance. Oh, yeah, of course he has Salamance. He has Molten Rays. And the Mega Evolves, too. Okay, this could be tough. Could be. But I'm not gonna lie. If we don't get one hit, or if we're faster, could, should, and would one hit. Okay, we're not faster. Our Rage doesn't do too much damage. A crit might kill, but Aurora Beam should kill. Quite effective. If I'm not wrong, it should be it. <laughs> We did it! Oh, we beat the game! Let's go! Pokemon Gaia complete! Player defeated champion Herschel. I'm speechless. I knew you were talented, but that was a superb display. Bravo! Ending it off with a woof. It's my pleasure to crown you the Orbis Pokemon League champion. It's about time I passed the reins on to somebody younger. Your passionate bond with Pokemon is a rare quality and has rewarded you bountifully. And there is one final reward to reap. Please follow me. And that is the Orbis Hall of Fame. So hey, thank you so much guys for watching and let me know what you want to see me do next and i'll see you guys later peace